Hey babes, so today I'm sharing with you guys an idea of some of the things I eat in a day. So some of you may know, some of you may not if you haven't been watching my channel for a while, but I am a vegetarian of three years. It's actually three years to be exact this month. It's kind of weird to say, I never thought I'd be a vegetarian, but <laughs> still so weird for me to say that. But honestly, it was the best thing that I could have done. It completely changed my life and my lifestyle and how I felt, my energy level, my skin. It honestly was the best choice that I could have made. But before this three year period, I was such a junk food addict. Like junk food almost every single meal. I'd stop at the gas station, I'd get pop and energy drinks, chips, I'd get candy, like those oatmeal cream pies like five times a day. <laughs> and because of that, I was constantly bloated. I looked like I was four months pregnant. I'm not kidding you. And I always felt like crap. There was twice that I could recall that I nearly blacked out at my desk at work because I, I just felt like crap. I thought I was deficient in something. I went to the doctor. I had my blood drawn because I swear I thought I was deficient. My blood sugar was low or something. But my levels came back fine. I was fine. I wasn't deficient. My lifestyle and my eating habits were just so terrible. And that's what was affecting how I felt and my energy level. So I hope you like this video. If you do, please thumbs it up. It helps me more than you think. And please subscribe. That also helps me more than you think. I'd love to have you a part of our YouTube fam. Also, please hit the post notification button so you never miss one of my videos. Everything that you need to know will be linked down in the description, so check that out before you go. If you have any comments or questions, leave me a comment in this video, and at the end of this video, I will meet you guys down there. I also think it's very important to say that I will always eat what I want. If I'm craving donuts, if I'm craving a cookie, if I'm craving ice cream, which is a lot, then I eat it. I never restrict myself or like tell myself that I can't can't have something it's all in moderation and in balance so I think that's really important to say I will splurge out on cookies in the morning like you know but I just like don't do it all the time and I don't do it every day like I used to so balance moderation happy yummy foods <laughs> but it's also about being healthy and being happy and like feeling healthy too so as a junk food addict turned vegetarian here is an example of what I would eat in the day full of protein high meals good carbs good healthy fats and some sweets here and there because I will never say no to cookies. <laughs> So first thing in the morning, about 20 minutes before I grab breakfast, I make apple cider vinegar with warm water. I add in lemon juice and sometimes I even add in honey for taste. The benefits of apple cider vinegar first thing in the morning is literally endless, you guys. Anywhere from digestion to your skin's complexity and I highly recommend it to everyone. I am literally addicted to lemon water and I will fill up this glass about four to five times a day with only lemon water. I swear it's like one of the only things that I drink. So about five days out of the week, you can find me making this yogurt bowl for breakfast. It is so nutritious and so yummy. You get all the different textures and flavors. And this is by far my favorite yogurt. It's by Silk. This is the mixed berry acai flavor, but I also love the peach flavor. I actually get the peach more than I get the mixed acai. And then I take whatever protein granola I have on hand. I always mix it up, get different brands, different flavors. Sometimes I even get it in bulk and all the kitties. I love them so much. So then I just chop up my favorite fruits. I normally go for banana, strawberry, blueberries, really anything that I have on hand and then I just top it together and I ended up mixing it all together. It is so good and it keeps me full for a few hours. So I also wanted to show you guys another breakfast that I make. It's very, very similar. I only typically get these on sale, these acai packets. They're very good and convenient, but they can be kind of pricey. So I only get them really when they're on sale. I add in my favorite mixed frozen berries, spirulina powder for the benefits and the protein, protein nut milk from Silk. I add a little bit of PB in there, and then my favorite protein powder of life, Vega in the flavor vanilla. I add everything to the blender cup. I add in my Thawed Out Acai packet. I add in a full banana and I blend it up. And then just like the yogurt ball, I add in my favorite fruits, banana, strawberries, and blueberries. I added in some of this vanilla strawberry granola. And here is a really easy way to have a acai protein bowl full of fruits and granola and micronutrients. For 
For lunch, I'm always craving something that's refreshing, has a lot of greens, a lot of veggies. So I love this go-to hummus veggie like packet wrap. It's so good. The tortilla is like so fluffy. I love it. I love this up with some of my favorite veggies. We have cucumber, green pepper, carrots, spinach, arugula, romaine, cabbage, like literally anything that I have in my fridge on hand, I just use it up. And I also have avocado, which just like makes the wrap 10 times better. I love avocado. So this is pretty self-explanatory. You just take the little pocket, you just open it up, spread hummus on the top and the bottom, and then you fill it up with all of your favorite veggies. You can put whatever else you want in here too. Just make it your own, have fun with it. And then I also added in a few little snacks. I added in the other half of the avocado and I just put salt and pepper on that. I also did walnuts and cashews, like a handful of each. And this was my lunch. Nutritious, healthy, yummy, flavorful, and filled with a lot of nutrients. So I'm a huge snacker. I love me some snacks. If I want something sweet, I go for this blueberry bar from Kroger. They are my favorite. If I want something savory, I go for these nan bread dippers. They're so good. And I dip them in garlic hummus or I'll even dip veggies in the hummus sometimes. It just depends on what I'm feeling. So for dinner, I'm always craving carbs and pasta. I love this pal pasta. This is penne. There's 25 grams of protein in this, you guys, and it's so good. I take my favorite marinara sauce and some of my favorite veggies. Today, I have spinach and mushrooms. I chop those up, and then with this dish, I'm going to have a side of sauteed kale, and you will see that right on my cutting board right there. I love seasoned kale with like anything. It's just so good, especially if you know how to season it right. Tempeh is another one of my favorites that is just protein packed it's so good especially if you know how to season it right you can pretty much add it to anything you don't taste it and it just gives you that much more protein it's a maze so i added a little bit of coconut oil to my pan and i just throw down my kale i seasoned it with minced garlic this italian seasoning salt and pepper and it is so good here is my final dinner it was delicious nutrient packed so flavorful and healthy protein packed and it just like looks so so good of course, this was just an example of what I eat in one single day. This is not what I eat every single day. I change it up, different flavors, different foods, different variations. There's always something new. I don't just eat the same thing over and over and over and over. I don't know who could do that, but I don't do that. If you like videos like this, please thumbs it up. I would love to do more if you guys would like to see it, so let me know. Hit the subscribe button and then hit the post notification bell, and I will see you guys in a few days with a brand new video. Love you. Bye.